This video shows the use of the Group Manager. Model Group Manager. In the Group Manager you can group items together. And in this dialog you can create new groups, you can delete existing groups, you can edit the name of the group, etc. The main group always contains all other groups and contains all items. Groups are mainly used for sources. This means that, uh, in this case, the group distribution center has five sources. Four point sources and one moving source. The group warehouse has four sources and the group wind turbine has one source. You can move items between one group to another group. I can click on an item and move it to the main group, for instance. So now I've moved the wind turbine to the main group. But of course the wind turbine should be in the group wind turbine because that's why I've created the group wind turbine. The effect of groups are visible in the main interface here with the active group bar. If you select distribution center you also automatically select all the sources, the items in the group distribution center. And you see it here in the list of selected items. Uh, similar for the group warehouse, you see these are the four sources in the group warehouse and they are selected here. The group wind turbine, it's only one source, the wind turbine, and it's selected over there. It's also visible, let me first start a calculation because I've just changed my group structure, I've moved the wind, uh, wind turbine, so I need to recalculate. You can also use the groups to show your results per group. So now let's show my calculated contours. These are my calculated contours for the group wind turbine. I can also change to another group. These are my calculated contours for warehouse. And these are my calculated contours for distribution center. So groups are used for grouping sources. And then you get more insight in the uh, results per group. Also in the table of results, on the single receiver points, you see here are the total results on point 1 until point 5 in the day, evening, night period. If I double click on point 1 and I select use groups, I see the result per group. So on point 1, the group distribution center has the highest level. I can also sort 44. And within the group distribution center, the source cooler bank has the highest contribution. So you see that groups can also be used in the table of result. They can be used here for viewing your contours and they are used for selecting items. Thank you very much for your attention.